Asthma is a chronic inflammatory condition that affects mostly the airways in the lungs, mostly the small airways, and it can cause chronic symptoms like coughing and wheezing and shortness of breath. It requires chronic inhaler therapies as a treatment and control, and it can cause varying degrees of what we call exacerbations or asthma attacks, resulting for patients to go into the emergency room or urgent care and get treated for that. But the goal of our treatments usually are to prevent those attacks from happening. There is no specific cause for asthma. However, there is a lot of factors that can exacerbate asthma if present. So we know patients with asthma have inflammation in their airways, and there is a lot of triggers that can trigger this inflammation in their airway, causing more airway narrowing and resulting in asthma attacks and resulting in those symptoms that we discussed before. Triggers like allergies, environmental allergies, triggers like perfumes, smells sometimes, smoke, pollution, sometimes if you're allergic to pets, for example, all these can be triggers for asthma, resulting in more inflammation and more symptoms. The most common treatment for asthma is inhaler therapies. The major component of the inhaler therapies are the inhaled steroids, and the goal from them is to keep that inflammation in the airway under control. So what is happening is that the steroid part is that when we inhale it goes into your airway, it gets uh, absorbed from there and then it controls the inflammation that's in the airway because mainly asthma is due to an ongoing inflammation in the airway. And the more inflammation there is, the more uh, symptoms you will get and the more airway narrowing and asthma attacks you might have. So the goal of the, those inhaled steroids is to keep that inflammation asleep if you want or under control. There are other inhaler therapies as well that will keep the airways open if you want and not very constricted and narrow in order to keep patients from coughing and wheezing all the time and being short of breath and being able to perform the activities they would like to perform on a day-to-day -day basis.